Sure. Um, very happy right now. Uh, really turned it around there after sets one and two. Um, kind of a gloom and doom feeling to be honest and then really we talked about like when we make subs trying to come in and be a spark and we definitely saw that with our subs today yeah we definitely saw that in set three mm -hmm. with sophie robinson and mm -hmm. Paul. They came yeah to mm -hmm. would you like to talk about their um performance today yeah um so sophie um just a good all-around volleyball player so we did think maybe trying her arm over on the outside I um, had to make some personnel changes due some due to some injuries, so I uh, just tried to get creative. Uh, I thought Sophie did a really good job of coming into that six rotation space, um, and then we moved uh, Claire Jones to libero. I thought she did a really good job. She reads really well, so just trying to get a, a little bit of a different defensive touch. Um, Nina uh, also came in as a right side. I know her attacking numbers weren't great, but she puts up a really solid uh, block. And then we also put in Bree Schreiman as well. Again, just trying to get some different hands in their in their space. We uh, they still had a really good hitting percentage. Um, ours still wasn't great, but we really climbed out of that hole. Uh, I feel like we bounced back after. Um, you know, maybe losing one or two points. I really felt that they were uh, going to do everything they could to get out of rotations. That fourth set was, <laughs> I was on pins and needles. It took a minute to get my heart rate back to normal. And how do we keep this intensity going in your second match against Yeah. I think, you know, we needed to feel that resiliency, that calm, and uh, again, making it about a team effort. Um, then no matter who we have on the court, we can win. And I think that just should hopefully help us rem remind us that so that if we make changes on Tuesday, and again, if we have some injury things we're dealing with, uh, we can be prepared. Thank you.